In FeatureCam 2014 R2, we've made some improvements to the stop model definition. In the past, when we created a stop model, any features that we added to the stop model itself could not be removed once they are added. This made it difficult whereby if you wanted to take the features out, you would simply have to delete the stop model and start again. We've improved this now by allowing the deletion of any of the items that you add to the stop model itself. In this case you can see you've got three roughing operations with three different tool sizes. If I go ahead and do a 3D simulation we can see each of the three stages with the 32, the 16 and the 8mm tool. If I go over to my stop model you can see I've got a pre-created stop model and if I open the stop model up either by double clicking or right clicking and going to the properties you can see here that I've got all the operations that have been added in. I may use this last operation for something like a referencing a, f a finishing operation, but in this case uh, I, I don't want to add it in, and in fact it's been added by mistake. So to remove it, it's quite straightforward now. I can select the feature I want to remove, or the operation I want to remove, and then just simply press this new delete button. You'll now notice it appears under the list of available operations. I can say OK, that accepts the stop model, I can go ahead and recompute it. The stop model is now referencing only these two operations. If I go back into the stop model itself, back into the properties, I can add the operation back just by simply pressing the plus key. However, we have to be careful as to which operations are using each stage of the stop model itself. In this case, if I go to the roughing uh, 8mm operation, go to the Z level and go to the stock tab, you can see in this case this is using the 16mm tool. So this is using that previous operation that was added to that stop model. However, there is a safety mechanism that's built into this to stop us deleting any of our uh, references by mistake. If I go back to this stop model and check the properties, you can see I've got the 16mm operation. If I go ahead and delete that roughing operation, you can see it appears under that available list. However, if I say OK, I get a warning and it tells me that the stop model operation cannot be deleted because it is be either based on the base stock or has been used by a feature. In this case, it's highlighted the one that I've tried to delete. So that makes our use of stop models a lot more efficient and a lot easier without making any unnecessary mistakes based on our previous references.